Assalamu alaikum. In this video I will talk to you about, the numerical miracle in the Quran. The miraculous number 7. At the first like this video to keep me motivated. And the end of this video is an important part of video so stay with us until the end. The numerical miracle in the Quran involves numerous numbers, of which 7 is the primary one. But why 7? It seems that this number shares a strong relationship with the way our universe was created and structured. The earth has seven layers, the crust, lithosphere, upper mantle, astenosphere, lower mantle, outer core and inner core. The atmosphere has seven layers, the troposphere, stratosphere, ozonosphere, mesosphere, thermosphere, ionosphere and the exosphere. Atoms, the basic building blocks of matter, have a seven-layered structure. The number of verses in the Quran that referred to the seven skies is actually seven. The word, the hereafter, is mentioned 70 times in the Quran, a multiple of seven. Hellfire has seven doors to it, and the number of times the word, hellfire, Jahannam, in Arabic is repeated in the Quran is 77, a multiple of seven. The first time God Almighty Allah mentions the number seven in the Quran was in chapter 2, verse 29 when he says, it is he who hath created for you all things that are on earth, then he turned to heaven and made them into seven firmaments, and of all things he hath perfect knowledge. 29 The last time Allah mentions the number seven is in chapter 78, verse 12 when he states, And have we not built over you the seven firmaments, 12. Now observe this. Furthermore, from the very beginning of chapter 2, the chapter which first mentions number seven, to the very end of chapter 78, the chapter which last mentions it, there are exactly 5,705 verses, a multiple of 7. Check it yourself. The number of verses that come before the first verse where 7 is mentioned is 35, which is a multiple of 7, and the number of verses that come before the verse where 7 is last mentioned is 5,684, a multiple of 7. This is only a small ounce of the many examples of the wonders of number 7 in the Quran, let alone other prime numbers such as 13 and 19 and others. But the question remains to all those who question the Quran's authenticity, could have all this happened by coincidence? Can this infallible accuracy have been sheer luck, or is there a precise system of mathematics that no one could have ever dreamed of concocting, proving through the language of numbers that this book is completely and utterly the word of God? Quran is the word of Almighty Allah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive you and me and all of the Muslims and if you like this video subscribe for more videos.